Hey everybody. Still Saturday. I'm back. Didn't think I was going to have anything to report. But here I am. Um, let me adjust this here just a little bit. Okay, I think that's good. Went to the mall. Just came back. Just came back. It's it's a nice day out. Now I find out that tomorrow is supposed to actually be a better day than today weather-wise. It's actually supposed to be a little warmer tomorrow. Whatever. I got things to do tomorrow, so I don't know if I'm going to go out. I, I would like to hit Dollar Tree. I saw the street in which I walk down in that other direct in the opposite direction where the mall is, but I have to walk the other way. That whole block, the whole sidewalk, nobody shoveled that whole sidewalk. So I don't think that I'll be going to Dollar Tree. Um, not anytime soon. So whatever they got is whatever they got. I don't know. I see so many YouTube videos that Oh, these great things are coming out. They got name brand, name brand products. And, uh, never mind. Never mind Dollar Tree. Okay, fine. Went to look for the backpack situation again, as opposed to my last video this morning. Nothing. Nothing is there. It's like, it's, it's, it's forget it. They still have the mini ears. They're cute, but you know what? I think I'm starting to steer away from the mini ears as well. I think I'm starting to steer away from ears. And that's, I don't know, that's kind of sad. I, th I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm changing. I have no idea. But anyway, made it to the Primark. Um, I, I don't know, it's one of them days for me. I kind of tested myself as opposed to getting something just to get something. But also at the same time, asking myself... It, I mean, in my head. Do I really need this in my life? This is what I was asking myself throughout the whole store. I knew I needed socks, so I had to pick up another pair of those. Those I need. They had, um, what did they have? More lip balms, which I did. Okay, let me just show you because they do have a whole Disney section. They have... Disney pillows for the couch or a bed. They're really nice. They're very nice. But you know what? For $10. They're only $10. Uh, the little throw blanket. They really had a nice gray one. I'm asking myself standing there in my head. Do I really need this? You know? Did you ever do that with yourself? I put myself to the test. So I think I did pretty damn good for the first shot. Okay? That includes going to Bath and Body Works. Now today... Bath & Body Works body creams are on sale for $5.95. Now, I could have blew through that store like a hurricane. That was, the, that was the second to the last store that I actually went into today. Do I really need this? I had a lotion in my hand, put it into the bag. Then I'm walking around the store and I said to myself, do I really need this? That lotion came out of that bag, went back on the shelf. I was very proud of myself. I mean, I really got to use what I'm using at home here first. I mean, it's it's like ridiculous. That includes hand sanitizers. So, all right. Let me show you. Okay. I stopped off at Box Lunch. There's a lot of things in that store I could have grabbed. I do not need them. Okay, but this I need because I think it's cute for the Easter, spring, and it is something for the home. So, it's not just a personal thing for me, but it's going to look cute. And I purchased the three-piece kitchen set. I thought these were cute. And you have all the Disney snacks. Love it. I have the oven mitt with the Disney snacks. Love it. And then the towel. I have a dish towel and it has little sprinkles on it. Love it. <laughs> uh, this was $19.90. So it was 20 bucks. Not a bad deal. Um, I also went up to the counter to ask, you know, is there anything that's on my account? Of course there isn't anything on my account. So I didn't get anything off. Now, the sad part is I have two coupons sitting here. 
I forgot to bring them. So this wouldn't this would have been a sale price for me, but whoo, it is what it is. So I thought these were cute. I thought now they had they didn't they didn't have they had a lot of Tiana stuff and they're celebrating the princess and the frog stuff and they're celebrating. I, I love the, the the Tiana's place shirt. Again, I do not need that now. So I let it go. This was good enough because I figured it was a purchase for the home. And it looks cute. So that's nice. I would like to get maybe another I usually like two towels. Or maybe three towels um, on my stove. I think I usually use two towels. Right now I have three towels. I don't know why. But anyhow, I don't have anything that match these colors. So I would like to maybe go to the Dollar Tree or another store to see if I can get a matching, you know, something within these colors so that I could blend it in. I like to have an extra towel. All right. Um, I was asking about the Princess and the Frog. Funko. They have no release date yet as far as when that's coming out. She says, you know, you got to keep checking maybe our Instagram page. She says, we usually do, we usually make announcements a lot on the Instagram page. I says, well, that's why I originally seen it. I said, but I think somebody else sent it to me. So I have my eye out for that. Um, I'm sure somebody out there is going to know something more than what they're giving out, you know, as far as information is concerned. All right. But anyway, I want to keep an eye. I, I would like to get her. She's cute. Really is. All right. All right. Going back to Primark. No card wallet. No card wallet holder. I was around that store. Now, I asked when I first walked in, I knew what I was looking for. I asked the gentleman that was there. He couldn't tell me anything. He says, I have no idea. He asked the woman that was passing by. She says, oh. She says, well, there was bags in the... I said, I know. I said, but they're no longer there. The only thing that was actually there was like the mini ears, and they were still hanging. The bags last last week were underneath the mini ears, so it was like a whole display. So that display just looks like it, it, got, it got robbed. <laughs> All the bags disappeared. Um, I was asking her about the card holder. She says... I never saw a card holder, she says, but they have other wallets and stuff over in the, on the other side. She says, where all the bags, you know, women's stuff is. She says, you may want to look there. So I did. I walked around that store four times. I mean, I was literally looking in every crack in every corner of the store just to see if I could see the card holder. They didn't have it. Okay. I move on. Um, but I did pick up. These are cute. I like flip-flops. I do. Hopefully these ain't too big. But I usually buy Primark mediums. I don't wear flip-flops out of the house. I don't like that. I don't like open-toe shoes. I just, I don't like that for my feet. I have issues with my feet. Um, and um, it, I have had issues with my feet since birth. So, But I do wear them in the house. And let's see if I can take these off. Can I take this off? Oh, I can. That was just a hanging it on the... Oh, okay. And here I have a nice pair of flip-flops of Mickey and Minnie. Are those adorable? Mickey Mouse, Mickey and Minnie. Mickey and Minnie. The sketchbook. Reminds me of the sketchbook Primark bag that I have that I got like months ago. <laughs> so these are cute. Nice flip-flops. These were, in fact, $4.50. So I picked up a pair. I just like to wear these in the house. That's that's what I do. Like I said, I don't wear open-toe shoes outside. So I'm very self-conscious about that, and that's my issues. Um, you know, even 54 years old, kids when I was a kid, uh, when I was a kid, you know, kids can be cruel, and I never forgot that. And these things, you know, from childhood, they just stick with you. So I don't like being made fun of. I don't like being stared at. It's just something that I don't like. And that's it. Okay. Those were, those were the flip-flops. One more time. $4.50. And they're thick. They're, ni they're very nicely made. 
very nicely made. I like the color. I like the, the um, I guess they're supposed to be red, but in certain lights, they look like they're coral, but they're red. Love the sketchbook. Very well made. Very well. And you can see Minnie. And you can see Mickey. Oops. Mickey. Come on, Mickey. Come on, Mick. Stop. Very well made. Okay. Now, along the way, I had said to you that I needed socks. I got my I got myself my new pairs of socks again. And I love these. These have actually went up in price. They used to be three dollars for three pairs. It was like a dollar a pair. As of now, they just went up on sale. They just went up for four dollars. So these are the new little sets. I like. She's laughing. And then I have the little hands. And then I have Mickey Mouse. I don't think I have Mickey. I only have Minnie. So this was good to see Mickey and Minnie in the same set. So. And that was it for those. Love, love Primark. Love Primark. They call them shoe liners. They call, you know, because Primark's from the UK. So they, they say things different. They're shoe liners. But they're, they're little, uh, little mini socks. I love them. Okay. What else? Now, I didn't need this either. But... For seven dollars, like last time I bought the Mickey Mouse shirt, I saw this shirt and I says, "Oh, you know, this is unusual. Another very well-made shirt." I, I and again, I have to get these in a two X because they run small. Although this one seems to be no, this one seems to be a little harder. That's okay. That's okay. I'm going to take off the two X sticky tag. And this is unusual, but I like it because it's Mulan. I love it. If you could see that, words, just a, just a t-shirt, just a t-shirt. I love it. <laughs> see this? I'm going to wear it. But this, I'm going to wear. <laughs> and this shirt was $7. So, But I thought it was nice. I love the Mulan. It's not, it's not cheap. It's not, it's not that silk screen crap. This is not going to come off on the shirt. This is actual material. And the um, words over here is loyal, brave, and true. Loyal, brave, and true. Very cool. So that that's a keeper. That's so I will be washing that tomorrow when I do some laundry. And what else? What else? What else? I found these over in the lip balm section. <laughs> like I needed more lip balm. The guy is looking at me and he's looking. I says, what are you looking at? He says, oh, I just want to make sure he says that they're, that they're together. I says, if you see Mickey and Minnie, they go as a set. Why would I break up the set? These were $3.50. I'm going to give them a shot. I like the packaging of them. That's one of the reasons why I purchased it. This is called Disney Love. And these are peach. One is peach scented, which would be Minnie. And Mickey would be cherry scented lip balms. I think these are cute. They have the little canisters. I think that's very um, high end looking, if you will. And these were $3.50. But as you can see, like you could separate, I'm gonna do that right now. You could separate the package. So the guy is looking at me. I says, it's a, it's a set. I said, they're all over there in the corner. It's a whole set, I said, for $3.50. Oh, oh, no, he says, I was just making sure. You can make sure until the cows come home. This is what I'm telling you. It's a set. So it's three fifty for the whole set. You get a Mickey and a Minnie. It's not three fifty. Believe me, I would never pay three fifty for one of these. Let's just get that out of the way right now. So I thought they're very nice. They're very high-end looking. I like them. So we will check those out. Then I see other separate ones. So this is a, well, they only say lip balm. They say vegan, vegan lip balms. And they have a whole new line now. So Mickey Mouse, it has um, with the world, they're saying like to save the world, help, help save the world. They have t-shirts and everything over there now in Primark that are help save the world. And this is one lip balm and it goes for $3. Again, these will probably be $2 way before the pandemic. They don't have a different scent on them or anything. 
It just says lip balm, but I will be giving these a shot. I like them for the packaging. Okay, so that was Mickey. And this is Minnie. That sticker's going to come off, I hope. Yes, yeah, see, that's Minnie. These are cute looking. And then I got one more. Might as well. Might as well have gotten one more. Oh, I got both of them the same? Oh, shoot. I thought they were both different. Okay. Okay, I got two of these the same. Okay, fine. I got two of them the same. I didn't realize that they were that they were the same. So I got two minis and one Mickey. Okay, no problem. And last but not least, on the way out the door, I thought this was cute. I said, you know what? I'm going to pick me up one of these. These were $2, and this is a little reusable shopping bag from Primark. So I just grabbed that at the register. Hopefully, that's a reusable bag. It doesn't say. It says one size. I hope it ain't a rain jacket. I hope it's a, it's a freaking bag. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to take it out now. Does anybody actually have the energy to refold these once you take them out of a, a little packaging? Does anybody have the energy to refold them and put them back in the way they actually were beautifully packaged? I have no patience for that. This will probably never see this bag ever again. Okay, let me see. This better be a shopping bag. Nice. Very cute. Okay. I was hoping it would say Primark on the shopping bag. It just has polka dots. Does it say Primark on the side? No, it doesn't. All right. It's just a, it's just a polka dotted shopping bag. But the package itself says Primark. Listen, for $2, I guess you can't go wrong. Okay. But this will never be folded like that ever again. <laughs> Alrighty. Last but not least, the Bath and Body Works. I just, I just, you know what? I just have enough. I just have enough lotions and stuff. I can't do it anymore. But what I did have my eye on is this cute little pocket back holder. It's pla it's rubbery plastic, so you'd have to be careful. I don't want to, I don't want to rip it. But this is the design on it. Now, I've seen this before, but... I says, you know what, let me get it. Let me just get it. And then you put your little pocket back in. I says, let me get it. I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. And this one was $5.95. And I'll just clip that to my bag. I thought it was cute with the design. Maybe it'll go maybe with one of my bags, who knows. And I do not need any more pocket backs. I don't need any more hand sanitizers. I have to use what I have now. I mean, I am just loaded. I am just loaded. I am the crazy pocket back woman. Like the crazy cat lady, I'm a crazy pocket back lady. But I did see this pocket back and it says, and it, and it, and it kind of struck me. It says, be a good human. I certainly will. I will. So, um, what flavor is this? It's not telling me. Simple citrus. Okay. Simple citrus. You know, usually they smell, sometimes they have the same smells as... Okay. That's cool. Very good. And, um, you know, you know, it just goes in. It goes in the holder. Like so. Did I really need it? No. But... And the pocket backs are now a dollar ninety-five. I hope you know that they used to be when I was when I was when I had these quite a few years back. They were like a dollar twenty-five. That's all they were. I still have, I think, the originals. Some of the original pocket backs from like a dollar twenty-five. Then they went up to a dollar sixty-five. Then they went up to a dollar seventy-five. So now they're one ninety-five. It is what it is. And that's all I spent for that. That's all I did. Nothing much. I I think this is like the less, the least bit of shopping that I've done. But then again, I just wanted to get out of the house for a little while and take a walk. You know? That's basically why I did what I did. And let me tell you, it's crowded. 
I had Burger King for lunch. I did stop at Burger King in the mall. They did allow us. It was very nice to eat in the food court. We did. You know, separated. You know, you're smart enough to separate yourself from everybody. I had my own table in the corner. I wasn't bothering anybody. They take your temperature when you go in. There's a there's a guard there. She takes your temperature before you go into the entrance. And um, they want your name and your phone number. That's it. No, and you're obliged to that. That's all. <laughs> you just ripped this package. I just want to try this Minnie Mouse lip balm. I'm not get. Oh, okay. I'm not getting. Oh, oh, it looks like. Okay, it's the same packaging as the other lip balm, the PS lip balm that I got. I love when it makes that sound. Okay, it, it's really nothing much. I want to say there's like a flavor to it, but I don't see it. Vegan. That's all it says, with shea butter and vitamin B. It looks the same as my other lip balms. I love the sound that these things make. I love that. My other ones do that. Yeah. Okay. So it's nothing unusual. It's the same lip balm, but they just packaged it. And they said, you know what? We're going to stick Mickey Mouse on it and it's going to make a fortune. <laughs> okay. Hmm. That's fine. That's fine. And you know what? I can always use lip balm, so it doesn't matter. Just want to make sure this cap is on right. This is called these these are actually made out of kind of like cardboard, so you have to be careful. All right. Okay, good enough. I would like to see, you know what? Should I try these? Maybe I'll just try one of these. See, like I said, they separate. So why would you separate a package with the words in the half? That's what I didn't understand what that guy was trying to uh pull a fast one on me. Okay, let's see. I just like the look of it. Why don't anything come out of a package today? Just why? Really? All right, just push this out. Okay. Um, all right. The bottom looks like it's pushed in, as you could see, but it's not. So take the sticker off. I'm just going to take that sticker off. That's what it looks like. This is what it looks like. I think it's cute. We'll see. Now, this one is supposed to be cherry flavored, cherry scented. Let's check it out because this is Mickey, cherry flavored. Minnie is supposed to be peach scented, so we'll see. All right. Okay. And, you know, I thought this was a twist off top. Well, it twists, but I guess you could just pull it right off. And you can. Cherry, the cherry scent is there. Okay, so there's no twisting of it. It just comes off. Now, I know I already have the other one on. You're not going to taste it. It's not that kind of a thing. But you smell it. It reminds me of a wax candle. That's what it reminds me of. You put a wick in it, it's probably a wax candle. Um, you push your finger on it, it just feels like wax. So, it doesn't really come off on your hand or anything. Okay. Well, you'll live and learn. Will I use it? Absolutely. Absolutely. I think it's cute to carry. And again... It looks high-end. So, would I buy these again? I don't think so. It was just nice. It was, you know, it's just nice something to have. And for $3.50 to try it. One, once, once, one try thing. So, I guess I, that's enough for me. L you know what? Let me try the peach scented. Let me try the peach anyway, because I'm, I'm nosy now. <laughs> Might as well just open up these packs. Okay. All right. 
I'm going to pull this off on the bottom again. Same scenario. It pushes in. Just pull that off. Hmm. Not really much of a difference in the color. The other one is red. This one's kind of like an orangey coral. And again, waxy. I pushed into it a little bit because I want to see. I know I'm putting flavor on top of flavor on top of flavor. Eh. You're not going to get a taste out of it. So just see, I pushed it in a little bit just to kind of scoop that wax out. All right. Reminds me of a candle. They, they, they did a candle. They did candle like wax material and they're now calling it lip balm. Okay. Sounds cool. <laughs> Go with that. But some products, they will, you know, stick Mickey and Minnie on anything. I'm sure they'll be selling out nicely, though. All right. That's it, people. I will leave you now. It has been a very nice day. Out here we have the snow, and I'll show you this one more time. I think, we could, I think you could see it through my window. Look at that. That over there is, my, uh, is the clubhouse to this building in which I belong, and there's a pool out there. So hopefully maybe this year, you know, I would like to use it. We couldn't use it. And that's sad. Um, they didn't get the permit for the opening of the pool, and I totally understand that. So got to be safer. All right, people. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. Have a great day rest of the Saturday. Have a great rest of the weekend. If anything else happens, if anything else pops up, if I really decide to hit the Dollar Tree, I don't think so. But if I do, I'll pop back on and let you know. All right. Have a great day. God bless. Be safe. Wear your mask.